Welcome to Germany! Honestly, I wanted to film and vlog the whole journey from leaving Vietnam, flying to Hanoi, getting the COVID PCR test down, flying to Qatar, flying to Germany. But honestly, I was so overwhelmed with the trip that I have snippets of videos of things, but it's not complete and it's not as I wanted to vlog the complete experience, but I still wanted to cut it together and share it. Enjoy! All around the world with Susie. We're back to traveling. So, let me see. I haven't seen makeup or a hairbrush for weeks. It's been a difficult time. Vietnam is back in lockdown since April. There's a new wave of COVID. Um, there's still no vaccinations inside here. And even though there was one week where we were back outside and I was really, really grateful. Um, it was only one week before we went into the next lockdown and it just has been emotionally very, very difficult and draining for me. And I feel like I'm done with Vietnam. So our place is a mess, which also doesn't contribute to the situation, but we kind of started packing, we kind of started giving stuff away, donating, getting rid of furniture that we bought over the last one and a half years here in Vietnam. What? How did that happen? And we're slowly but surely getting ready, trying to get out of here. As I don't know what's going to happen and where we're going to end up, I can't say a lot yet, but I'll take you along the journey. Hoping that we have an end result at the end of this video. 22.5! Just not enough. years of Vietnam it was the best time we were so lucky for the longest time because they had such strict restrictions there were months and months where we had zero COVID in the country at all and just after we left cases went up like crazy and the situation is really not good so sending love and I'm still very close to all the people who are still there and I'm still following along and that's also why I'm really really grateful about how the situation is in Europe. I have experienced the pandemic from a very, very different perspective than most people. So yeah, I, I get to experience a lot of freedom here in Europe at the moment and all the things that seem to bother other people don't bother me at all. I'm just really, really grateful and happy. Well, there is a couple of people, not many. Exploring the room. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> it's a bit dark in here, but oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> it's like no wall between the. There's a door, but no wall. It's true, 
did not know where we would want to go for the longest time it was like this crazy time where we were like spinning the globe and we were like where are we allowed to go where are borders open where could we get vaccinated can we go to turkey croatia australia what are the things and it was a wild very uncertain time honestly i mean i say that now looking back i'm very grateful that we are in germany but it was so wild in the end we decided to come here because of vaccinations because we wanted to find a spot and it's not super easy if you're a digital nomad. We wanted to do it in Turkey, but it didn't work on a tourist visa. You would need a registration card. And then Australia, we couldn't just go there because they have quarantine for $4,000. And Germany, we were able to get it done, even for Andy, which was also, oh, we were just so lucky um, because we don't live here. We don't have health insurance here. We're not registered here, but fingers crossed, we got an opportunity and we are really grateful for it and now that part is ticked off and done being back in germany after leaving so many years ago i think i left eight years ago now crazy is like i'm really happy this time i'm so grateful for the freedom that there is here for the fact that we escaped a long 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 tough lockdown in vietnam it's still ongoing for months and months and uh, we got everything here that we need that we have german bread rolls that it's summer that i get to see my family and friends again hello <laughs> hello <Yes>. oh. <laughs> Hallo. Ich muss ich jetzt, das ist mir wurscht. Das ist auch bestimmt negativ. Wir machen gleich nochmal einen Test, aber wir haben schon einen gemacht. Oh, ah, hallo. Gott, nein. Ha, hab ich dich nicht gestern noch was gefragt? <lacht> There might be more travel vlogs in the future, but honestly, the first couple of weeks here, I just wanted to arrive, settle, get myself sorted, and move on with business and with life. And now we'll be back. Talk to you soon.